This is Emily Yoshida, and I'm the entertainment editor from The Verge, and I just saw Star Wars. Hey, it's Ross. Uh... We just saw Star Wars. Hey, it's Casey Newton out in San Francisco. We are in Brooklyn at the Brooklyn Academy of Music. We're a little dazed right now. I just watched Star Wars The Force Awakens here in Waterloo, Ontario, Canada. It's here at the world premiere in Hollywood, California. Uh, and... what I think? Um... I felt a lot of things tonight. Um, I, uh, a lot of kind of like childish, wonderful exuberance and joy. Lots of nostalgia feelings, lots of Millennium Falcon, lots of Han Solo. <laughs> the acting is great and that makes such a difference. So much more than effects or anything like that. Good performances where you believe in the characters is all that you really need to sell the universe. I love the new characters. Ray was great, Finn was great. Anytime they were on screen, it was my favorite part. The chemistry between the, the new trilogy of leads was, was really good and I'm excited to see how they uh, play off each other as we roll into episode eight and episode nine. Yeah. Yeah. C3PO still sucks. Yeah, c 3 is still sucks. character. More than anything else though, uh, it was the first time probably since 1983 that I've been in a movie theater and saw something that just actually felt like Star Wars. It just felt right. And that was just a wonderful, wonderful relief. It, it, just, it really just felt like Star Wars in some respects. Like it just, it was calling back to the original trilogy in beautiful ways. It largely ignored the prequels, which is fine. There's nothing about the governance of the Empire. It's just all about chases and finding things and getting things and uh, just sort of very relatable human drama. I also don't remember Star Wars being that funny. That was a plus. I don't know what I was expecting in terms of the humor level of a new Star Wars movie, but it exceeded it. There's not a negative message in Star Wars, and that's what this is the biggest reminder of. Star Wars is um, a really optimistic and fun and imaginative universe, and this totally is in keeping with that. So, I'm like the rest of all these people. I'm having a good time. And just... I, I can't get over it. I can't get over it. Yeah, that's, that's about it. That's all I can say. That's all I got. I'm sorry. <laughs>